Lee Zeldin defended Donald Trump more than any other Republican in America. Tonight, a new campaign ad from Governor Kathy Hochul calling Lee Zeldin an extreme Republican as the race for New York governor remains a close one. The first female governor, right? Get that? In Brooklyn, Democratic Governor Kathy Hochul campaigned inside a Borum Hill Senior Center. We're just getting started, protecting our subway, making sure there's cameras out there, helping people who are severely mentally ill. Paula Smith listened closely. She wants to hear from both candidates on... The violence, the problems that we have in the night. PIX11 News wanted to ask the governor about her Tuesday night debate performance, but when one protester showed up at the senior center and refused to leave, the governor left without taking questions. And over in Queens... This is truly a campaign about being able to take back our streets. Republican candidate Congressman Lee Zeldin rallied with local gas station owners who said they are tired of being targets. We are uh, getting robbed every week. Zeldin campaign events have largely been focused on safety and on crime. So we questioned Zeldin. What other issues would he focus on for New Yorkers as governor? Right now, we really have an urgency in lifting up our game inside of our school system. Uh, very much appreciate your question. The candidates questioned each other Tuesday night during the only debate ahead of Election Day. Hochul pressed Zeldin on his ties to former President Donald Trump. Is Donald Trump a great president? I worked closely with him on a... a I'll take that as a, I would take that as a resounding yes. Zeldin questioned Hochul on the COVID-19 nursing home controversy when she was Andrew Cuomo's lieutenant governor. Why don't you speak up with regards to the deadly nursing home order and cover-up? I have called for a comprehensive... Overhaul. During the debate, Kathy Hochul stressed Lee Zeldin's conservative views on abortion. Zeldin said as governor, he would not push to change New York's current abortion laws.